I the uh, one and only Blue Jay. Indeed you are. Uh, Dan, we're going to make this 3 out of 5, all right? This match is going to be 3 out of 5. Did you tell them? Yeah, I told them. Oh, you told them already? Okay. Yeah, we're good. All right. Uh, looks like a strike to Dreamland. Oh, he's going Falco. Okay. Yeah, he's uh, he really wants a lot of Falco uh, footage since we actually have a legitimate stream now. Okay. And that, that the VODs are actually going to be uploaded. That's cool. Yeah. So this will be a pretty quick match, I assume, since it's Spacey's. <laughs> yeah, Spacey's. And these are both, they're both very fast Spacey's. Yes. They're and not. their punish game's insane. Mm -hmm. And uh, Irv looks like he's playing well today. Uh, I don't know about Eichelman. I haven't really watched Eichelman play. I Ooh. Yeah, I haven't seen Eichelman play at all. That was risky. Yeah. That's the Irv classic, though, dude. Irv goes for risks. That's true. He, he goes for reach, for sure. Nice yeah. short. Yeah, nice short. He wouldn't be able to grab that. Into the classic ledge dash up there. Oh, he's <laughs> doing, doing silly stuff. Nice double shine. Oh, whoa. Backwards jump from the ledge. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why people do that. It's like not very good. No, it's very risky too. Because if you get hit out, then you have no jump. Yeah. And you're just dead. <laughs> That's why I noticed about Eichel what Eichelman does. Uh, he'll. Uh, that was very nice. Yeah, that was very nice. Shine turn around. Shine turn around. Wave around wave, yeah. Um, what I was gonna say was Eichelman does that thing where he uh, he'll jump off ledge and do the double laser from ledge. Oh, like he'll he'll run off and then B reverse oh, yeah, double yeah. laser off from ledge. That's good for edge guarding in my opinion mainly. No, but like he does it onto stage. Oh, weird. I mean, if you don't have a lot of stage, then it can be okay just to like try to get yourself uh, nice an opportunity there. off the lasers. But then, uh, oh, nice pork chops. Around there. <laughs> pork chops classic. Now oh, Cody was about that ish. <laughs> Ooh, nice. That was very nice. And back air. Yeah, that's gonna be it. Yep. So it's pretty even so far. Yeah. Just kind of going blow for blow. <laughs> there's kind of yeah, there's kind of swinging at each other. The oh, old, oh, old he drill from the ledge. <laughs> Oh, nice oh, shine. shine shield. Oh, oh, no. Oh. oh, no tag. <clears throat> Interesting run off the platform, double jump there. Yeah. I, don't, I don't really know what that was supposed to be, if that was supposed to, or if that was what he's tending. It seems like Aquaman's being kept caught by a lot of these drills, like either full uh, hop or double jump dead. drills. Yeah. He could attack that, but. he was. I think he was a little too low to attack it, unless he hella yeah, smashed the in. I saw the, like animation of hitting the stage. He oh no, I think that was Eichelman, because Eichelman traded oh. with the uh, up B. I could be wrong. But. You, you can also smash the item so you can tech it. Yeah, so, so I'm going to guess Earth's going to go to Yoshi's. Uh, oh no, Pokemon. Huh, so he's really? not trying to rush him down then, I guess. Yeah. Uh, I think in this matchup, really it comes down to style, what, um, what stage is actually good. Oh my god. That was really nice. Earth's just not letting up. I think that's a dead Falco, Ooh, yeah. Yep. He didn't have any options. Like, he went down, he got forward smash, he went up, then he was charged forward smash longer, and then yeah. hit him. <laughs> oh, beautiful Herb's shine. Doing, doing a lot of shine yeah. back airs. He's, uh, he's, well, he's uh, keeping the corner pressure on really well, actually. Well, just in general, like, watch, he's doing a lot of shine back airs. Not like shine nares. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. Woo! The gangsta laser. The gangsta laser is <laughs> the, uh... The full hop. <laughs> Planned. That is the YOLO uh, forward smash. Nice oh, nice. Yeah, beautiful reaction. short. Alright. Uh, oh, he saw his double jump. Ooh, oh, gets burned. Looks like Eichelman's really messing up like a lot of small but important things. Like, he just barely missed space on that up B. He accidentally killed himself when he. I don't know. I don't remember what he was trying to do. But. <laughs> Shines. Shines the laser there. All right. The 2003. <laughs> the classic, dude. Well, you know, Irv, both these guys are from, like, pretty old school. Yeah, no, uh, I think Irv has been actually playing longer than... No, I think they've been playing about the same time. Like 2003, 2004. No, no. Or... Eichelman hasn't started... Didn't start playing until 2006, I believe. 2006, 2007. Okay. Irv's been playing for... Yes. Back when Ken was... Back when Ken was uh, the king. <laughs> oh boy, Ken! All right, yeah. Easy yeah. down air. Easy yeah. down air. Simple. All right, so Eichelman's still down a full stock. Something, something. One stock's not a lead. The classic, uh, you know, I mean, trope. Oh, it, nice. It definitely spin. is a lead, but it's easily overcome. Yeah. All right. Wow, so Eichelman, Eichelman missing like a lot of stuff. Yeah, a lot of like little things, like uh, execution things mainly. Yeah, I think he might switch. From Falco? Oh, no, maybe no. not. All right, Battlefield. Might be a prideful set. 
trying to get his Falco more experience. I hope so. He always, like, the thing about Ian is that he always says, like, oh, yeah, I'm going to go Bowser this tournament or something like um, that. And then, like, he'll lose, like, a set to, like, Ace, and then he'll just yeah. go try hard Ganon. See, I think... And, like, he, he says he wants to, like, I don't know. The thing I think about uh, Ian's Falco is it's really good, uh, like, in neutral game with, like, lasers and stuff, but once you get close to him, it seems like he's not as comfortable. Like, it seems like... Just just watch the neutral nice. exchanges every time that uh, he's too close to shoot a laser. Just yeah, watch no, there. like, if Irv gets in, it's just like he he really gets in. Yeah. Oh, bad coverage. Oh, nice but jab I mean, reset. I haven't seen much, like, uh, baiting up tilts or, like, out of cancel back airs, so I'd like to possibly see an adjustment from Ian if he, uh, Eichelman, if he continues. Yeah. That's a nice back air. Interesting choice in the side B, though. He was, clearly wasn't going for the ledge. Ooh, I like that. I like that dash chance right outside of his range. He really couldn't do anything. He was just covering it. Ooh, nice. Nice. I don't know if that was reaction or read, but either way, that was a very nice up smash. I don't know. It's the, the line between reaction and read is very, it's very confusing sometimes. It's like a blurry line. <laughs> Eichelman trying the noob killer there. And, uh, oh, my gosh. Four, ooh, double nice jump, pressure. Full, double jump. Uh, or double shine, full hop, back air. <laughs> to double shine. It was yeah. auto canceled, so why not? Ooh, nice back air. Shine. Really? Ooh, yeah. yep. That's it. Poor Falco, dude. <laughs> so Eichelman taking that first game pretty handily, and then just Irv's just, I don't know if he's adapted. Well, or... Irv's definitely oh. So got us. Yeah. Yes! Irv's adapting to what's going on, and Eichelman's getting frustrated, he's missing some things, and yeah. Uh, if you watch Eichelman, he's shaking his head a little bit. Can it? Mm, it's winter still. He, he's thinking about it. Oh, he's going to I knew it. I knew it. All I right. wasn't sure if he wanted like the whole set to be Falco and then he play Ganon and losers or what. I mean, the thing I don't understand is like Eichelman says he wants to get his Falco ready for out out of state tournaments when he starts going to out of state tournaments again. Mm -hmm. But he every time he loses with Falco, rather than sticking it out, he always goes Ganon. And you're never going to really oh my get god that forward is so mean. unless you put yourself in situations where you might lose as that character like in a set. Yeah, like, exactly. Like and, uh, you'll see us. Uh, like, lo character. losing losing's part of getting better. Yeah, oh, absolutely. You can't always win. Like, if you always win, like, you might improve, but you'll, you're will you not going to improve at, nice like, shot. a fast enough rate because it means that no one's challenging you. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so this is pretty even. Oh, there's the Ganon double shine. <laughs> <laughs> that was very nice. Oh. So I feel like, um, I don't know. Oh, that was really yeah, nice. Yeah, that, that was a really nice tidbit. Uh, what were you saying? I just feel like Irv's, like, scared when he plays his Ganon. Uh, when he plays against Cyclone it's, Ganon. It's a, it's, a I, scary, I it's think, a scary character I for sure. I think it's scary because when you get hit, you get hit so hard. Yeah. Um, and it's so easy for him to, like, edge guard and kill you. But you, you got to think, I think of him as, like, a, he's like a... A slower, uh, I don't even know if he's harder hitting, but he's like a slower, more zoning version of Falcon. I think he's definitely harder hitting than Falcon. But well, with like Stomp and Neem and stuff like that, like mm -hmm. Falcon hits pretty dang hard, but... The Falcon has combos, he too. He has more so. combos, yeah. That's why I, I didn't really want to say, like, hitting harder, because, like, when he hits you, he really, really hits you, but... Nice. Irv's keeping on this pressure really nice. Ooh. I think... Nice. He's keeping him in the corner, which is you really need, good. You need to. I mean, nice. Because one of one of uh, Ganon's biggest selling points as a character is how his forward air and back air can zone so well because they have such uh, massive disjoint and yeah, like, range. massive disjoint, and massive range, and like people are just like straight up scared of them just because they hit so hard. They they come out pretty like pretty quick for like how strong they are, but they're actually not like the quickest areas. Which is why he, you'll see Eichelman in general isn't trying to be close to him. He's trying to yeah, keep, he's, like, he's, he's spacing himself yeah. just so like oh nice. Yeah, oh, oh my god. No tech. He <laughs> wasn't expecting that there. Yeah. <laughs> well, Irv right, Irv, Irv needs to be careful here. Ooh. The thing is, Ganon nice can't shot. can't capitalize off that. Like he got the forward air, like yeah. he won neutral, but he just got 26 or 24 percent or whatever the forward air does, and that was it. Uh, ooh, this, this could be, I yeah, think that's it. that is terrible DI. Yeah. Oh, nice angle, that, but... That was very nice. He covered multiple options with the up there into four tape. So we got uh, game five coming up. Yeah, game five. Um, yep, Eichelman staying I think Ganon. FD. 
Oh, he's going back to Dreamland? Dreamland. Yeah, um, I don't know. Just, Let's see. I'm just thinking... Um, uh, I don't know. FD is... It, FD or Fountain, those, those are what the I mean, typical counter yeah. picks would be. Just he, because uh, the reason for FD is you force Ganon into a mix-up of... He either does... Uh, oh, he's going back to Falco. Oh, interesting. Nice, okay. Uh, I was going to say, he has the mix-up basically of short hop... Uh, uh, short hop forward air, or short hop double jump forward air, and that's about it. So he's feeling more confident in his Falcon on this stage, it seems like. Yeah, or he heard me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, like, I respect it though. I He wants his Falcon to improve. good tournament experience. Like, yeah. there's only so much playing in friendlies, even if it's against good players, like, can get you. Even if you're an experienced player, like... Nice shot out of shot. Nice, nice back air. Nice edge guard it. Oh, oh no. no, Irv, you bastard. Oh, PC. Rip, or <laughs> Esports. <laughs> All right. Oh, that was really yep, nice. Yep, that's it. There's the, nothing. There's nothing the, Falco can do there. Uh, you can shorten. No, the, no. I mean, I mean, uh, when after oh, when he after he, got, yeah. after he got hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's yeah. absolutely. I nothing. mean, you're, you're you're dead. <laughs> you can't really do anything. Oh. oh. Ooh. Ooh, down nice. smash. I don't like the down smash there personally because you can a tech the down smash and it's actually harder to time than the down air because the down air is elastic hitbox. <laughs> oh, nice lasers. Interesting. It didn't look like he was ready for the uh, instant side B. Yeah. He maybe thought he was gonna go lower. Maybe. Good full hop, good full hop, hop over. Right. Yeah, he baited the short hop uh, neutral air approach from Irvin, just jumped over it. Yeah. Basically. Nice lasers. See, I think on this stage, uh, Irvin doesn't really chain grab. So, like, the advantage of going to this stage versus Falco is somewhat lost. Yeah, no, I think Earth's may maybe just comfortable on here. We've seen it's, him. It's a very old school, like, a lot yeah. of old school players love FD. Yeah. Ooh, that was oh, he took his he's DJ. Catching him, he's catching him with the uh, very old school full hop nares. Uh, full hop nares. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like there it is again, <laughs> and there it is again. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually surprisingly difficult to deal with this Falcon. Nice tag. Ooh, I don't think the oh. ledge there again was the right option. No, he should have got back on uh, the stage and maintained stage position. Nice back here though. That's yeah, gonna seal it. All right. All right, got last stock situation. Um, this could. Go either way, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it can. Oh. Well, he's catching with the full full hop approaches. Yeah. Oh. Nice job. He, he uh, <laughs> did the up tilt a little too quickly. Try to cover uh, the. No I think he should have grabbed the there instead. Oh. Uh, I think. It depends. Oh, oh no! Yeah. Oh no! I hate it. All right. Sets in like that. Um, you get the thing is if you got the up tilt because Eichelman was at like 90-ish percent, uh, you get up tilt up air, mm -hmm. and then that depending on the. Uh,